Good morning, you guys. I hope everyone's having a great day so far. Here I am, last minute packing as usual, but as promised, again, kind of a similar start to last week. We have a super fun day planned, super fun week planned. We are about to go to the airport to fly out to LA for just a fun time and some work things, but majority fun time. So, yeah, hope you guys are ready to watch. Let's go. You ready for our adventure? Yep, you guys all have a day. Just like that, we are leaving again. made it. Now time to go wait in these terrific horrible lines because it's spring break. Actually I got pre-check. <laughs> no one cares. <laughs> Why are you always wearing your sunglasses? Because my contacts and I'm blinking a lot and I look like a weirdo. I think you're trying to look cool to be- no, Oh I'm genuinely not my god. Oh. This is a joke. This is not even funny. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> finally through that was easy pretty seamless for me because I was super tempted this week and I went and got pre-check and did a, the digital ID thing so it was pretty easy but apparently mom's bag was overweight so they charged her a hundred bucks which sucks but I'm an idiot and forgot sunglasses so now I have to go somewhere and find me a pair hopefully not get destroyed for a price but we'll see so I made the mistake in that got myself some new shoes the other day. I'm paying for it right now because they're not broken in at all. <laughs> this is just a struggle. I'm trying to find me some shades. <sighs> so sunglass hunting was a fail. I couldn't find anything under like 400 bucks, so <laughs> not doing that. But uh, I guess I'll just have to hold off and wait until I don't know, I have a nice pair at home, but I just, I can't justify spending that kind of money just for this week. So I'm just gonna have to get a crappy pair in, in LA when we land. But it's supposed to be raining there anyway, so I think I should be fine, at least for today and tomorrow. But after that, I'm gonna need something. Rub on some donuts. Actually, no, I'm not, but. You're boarding at what, 10.15? Yeah, 10.15. Tony, you want a chocolate milk? Oh, yes, please. And we'll get you a coffee. Thank you. Options on options on options. I have no idea what I'm gonna get. Um, I don't know what to get. I feel like unhealthy eating this stuff, but I love it. Yeah, I'm not getting into that junk. Yeah. I am. <laughs> To get on the big plane. Ugh, not ready for this line though. You excited? So excited. <laughs> I feel like I asked that question so much. No, but, but I've never been to LA before. You know, been to same. San Diego, San Francisco, but never Los Angeles. So. And we're going for some exciting reasons. So Here we go, City of just, Angels. I know. I'm we're doing it right. We're doing it right. Yes, we are excited to do this right. We're so excited. So excited. Um, wait, I want everyone to know something. Jack has pre-check and digital ID. Yeah, I've already told them actually. I'm sure you did. How was your security line? He also said, I told you so the entire time. <laughs> who were waiting in security. And I said it before, but I didn't feel bad leaving them because I gave them all the opportunity to get it. And I told them what they needed to do and how to do it. And they just said it was stupid. I know it's not worth we it. We did not say it was stupid. Some of us have full-time jobs that we had to be at and couldn't run around and do all of it. Okay, well, whatever. I have a free chicken to tell idea and save my butt <laughs> security, but. Giant. 
took off. We're now en route. Waiting for our bags. Happy to be here. I've got a dream in, in a cardigan. In rainy again. LA. I've got a dream in a cardigan. Now going to our, the car to go to the hotel. So yeah, it was a little bit of a bumpy flight at the end, but it was pretty, pretty smooth other than that. So we did indeed end up making it to the hotel. It's actually a beautiful, beautiful hotel. So I'm excited to show you guys around. But yeah, interesting travel day. It was pretty seamless, but towards the end of the flight, there was like a whole issue with us landing and it got really rocky. But I've, I mean, besides that 30 minute delay, everything was pretty, pretty straightforward. But another thing that was crazy here, it was like to get into a store, it was inside the airport to get into a little convenience store, I had to pay first. And then when I walked in, I grabbed what I wanted and just walked out. I'd never heard of that. So that's pretty foreign to me, it's pretty cool. But um, yeah, so now I think we're just going up to get a bite to eat. Um, and yeah, I'll catch up in a little bit. Elevator. Oh God. I don't like elevators at all. This one sounds cranky too. Neville R. Food? Check out this view. Hollywood sign. The view is actually beautiful and it's finally starting to clear up. It's been really rainy only for the last day, so, but this is just, you have to see this. Check it out. Oh, look at that. Hollywood sign. And now we are about to go to some, the Chinese theater. I probably sound like an idiot for saying it like that. And then, obviously the stars, and then we're gonna come back and shower up and clean up from the flight and then go get ready for dinner, so yeah. Ooh, wait, real quick, I have to show you the pool. Oops, slippery, hold on. Check this out. What's up, Connor? Did you grab my tote bag? I got everything, I got your tote bag, your suitcase, everything's in the room. What do you think about all this? Uh, that, that's cool. Got Mini ball. Is there, is there something else in the other door? Take it. Is there something else in the other door or no? Is it? Let's check. Just out the door. Sweet. Well, room tour. Bathroom. There's me. Shower. Nice shower. Got a little station right there. That. This is the most important part of this hotel room. The most important part. Right here. Connor and Hathaway. Hey, hey. Army Richard. Jackie Chan. Take my bags for a second. I was looking for that one. It's the Avengers here. That's him, baby. Robert Downey Jr., Chris Evans, Chris Hemsworth, Scott Johansson. How cool is that? Wait. Uh, John. How many stars are there? 
The Beatles, the King, baby. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, baby, Priscilla. So Connor and I have just gotten ready for we're going to dinner, right? Yeah. We're actually going to dinner with some very special people. And they, well, we're not sure about one person coming, but we know two of them are very special people. All three of them, they're all special people, but we know for a fact two will be there. A third may also be there, but that's going to be a surprise. It's going to be super exciting. And I'll give you a little outfit. But yeah, I basically just got this black cargo's on, which I wear all the time. Just a white Nike t shirt. Eek. And then I'm gonna wear some Air Forces. And then, yeah, so we are getting ready for dinner. And we're getting ready to. I said getting ready 17 times. I should probably cut that out, but I won't because that's. It's gonna be raw. It's gonna be a raw vlog. But uh, yeah, so we're going to dinner. So final outfit, we got the Central City Black Cargo's White Air Forces because for some reason it's freezing cold in LA. So, that's mint. Now I'm just gonna whack on some cologne. Let's see, go Versace today. I'm not gonna do too much because I loaded it last time. Just do two squirts. Heel. Is this the carne asada? No, well, this is carne asada. I ordered carne asada. So we did just finish up with dinner. It was a super good time, super good restaurant and everything. But here is one of our special guests I was telling you about. Let's go. This is Ben. This is actually Abby from the show's oh, brother. Yeah, Abby, you want to say hi? Ab, say hi. It's YouTube. Come on. Hi. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's raining. I it don't is, want to get caught in the rain. It is raining, but we had a super good dinner, and it's been a blessing to meet them. But we're going to go to a city walk right now, I guess, at Universal Studios, and uh, yeah, we'll see what's going on there. But it's been a great time meeting them. Okay, so where are we going? Where are they going? I don't know. We're going to the city walk. Okay, let's do this. First of all, what time is it for us at back at home? So you come to LA for sunshine and warmth and instead we get freezing cold rain i feel like we're back in new york but we're going to meet up with abby and them right now to get some dessert so yeah fill you in <laughs> yeah we're coming to la to get rain on oh, this is not how it normally is this is sweet though this is sweet worth it Connor, are you fun? I'm fun. Yeah. Even though we're soaking wet, we're having a blast. I saw it. I... Thank God to Ben. He's yeah, for real. taking us around. Always. Wow. This is crazy. Oh, there's a little splash pad. 100 bucks if you can get across that. Yeah, no. <laughs> I don't need to walk through that. It's not going to change anything. It's soaking wet. Yes. Options upon options. Oh, okay. crazy! Oh, God. I can't. I can't. Really don't know what I'm gonna I get. Don't know. I really don't know. They're big donuts. They're kind of big. Good night, guys. Can I see but delicious? Can I see but good? That was actually so good. What do you think, Connor? Good. I know. I'm like. All right, Connor. What store is this we just found? The Universal Studios Hollywood Production Center. Universal Studios Greatest Monsters. I see some classic posters in there. Looks pretty cool. Looks right up your alley, I'll say that. It is. What is that? Is that in... Wow. Oh, is that the... Oh, oh yeah, it's a hoverboard. We're in a uh, movie memorabilia store. Oh, man. 1200 bucks. It's not that... Yeah, you need a picture of it? Yeah, I'll take a picture. 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 Yeah, picture. Yeah, I'll take a 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 Say I've had a great time meeting you. I had a great time meeting you too. You're one of my best friends now. Thank you. I can't wait to meet David tomorrow. That's gonna be super fun. Last, I'm gonna help. Eat so much.
Okay, I know my hair is a complete disaster, but just like that, we finished our evening. Our very special guests were Abby and her family from the show. Tomorrow we have a super fun thing planned. Uh, but again, just stay tuned to watch that. Um, but yeah, we had a good night. We are absolutely beat. We've been up since like 3.30 in the morning LA time. And it's, I think, 10? We'll see. It's 10 o'clock right now as we speak. So we're tired, but yeah. Thank you for watching. And well, no, we'll continue into tomorrow. So Good morning, everybody. It is like early. It's like 7 a.m. And... We've been up since like five because our bodies just haven't adjusted to the timings yet, but we will. But today we have a few things going on. Christine, Abby's mom, is picking us up here in a little bit. And she's going to kind of take us around. the. We did some touristy things yesterday, which I, you should have seen uh, earlier, but... Lots of paraphernalia. Oh, no, 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 not paraphernalia. <laughs> memorabilia. Memorabilia. Yeah, there was lots of memorabilia, yes. But uh, today we're going to go do just some more touristy things. I think we're going to go to Santa Monica. We're going to go up to the Hollywood sign, so that should be fun. And then later this evening, we have a super fun event planned, um, which is going to be like the highlight of everything we've done. So uh, I can't wait to share that. But yeah, so we are about to get up and get ready to go. Yummy, yummy room service. You excited, Connor? Yep. It looks so yummy. Now we are just off to go meet Christine and Abby for a day of fun. So, yeah. Academy Museum of Motion Pictures. So see the Oscars, guys? Oh my oh, gosh, yeah. how cool. That's All an right. Oscar. So here we are. So I'm going to let you guys out right okay, here. Thank you, Christine. And um, meet you. What, what I'll meet you. I mean, they wow. This is pretty sweet. It's called the Dolby Family Terrace. This is an unreal view. Look at this. It's, got, it's massive. Then you just got the hills out there, and then there's the Hollywood sign. That's pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. This is actually the Academy Museum of Motion Picture. So there's like a whole bunch of different uh, little exhibits and stuff we've been through. The Oscars experience was just one little part of it, but it was super fun, super cool. I'll insert the video. I look like an idiot in it, but it is what it is. But yeah, I guess this is just like an events terrace or a viewpoint. It's pretty sweet. So, and they uh, they are hooking it up for us for sure. So shout out to the uh, the museum, 100%. So all the costumes. Sweet Elvis, baby. We did just finish up at the museum. It was a super fun time. There's a lot of fascinating pieces here. But now we're going to In and Out, which I've never had, which I'm excited about. And then we are going, I need sunglasses, and then the Hollywood sign. So, yeah. First time trying it. Cannot wait. But, um, Always listen to Connor. Your Connor tried to tell us they were closed and did, did we there were so many people here we didn't realize it. The so they're closed. Oh no in and out we today. Are just sitting there. We're gonna, get it, okay, we'll get it before we leave. There she is. Oh. Hollywood. Oh wow. It's like crazy so to be this close. Yes, that's the best. So this is a view. <laughs> of Los Angeles, uh, City of Angels right here. Out there, and then there's like this reservoir, it's like a freshwater reservoir. And then you got the Hollywood sign just right there. It's pretty cool. It's crazy to me, we were saying like the terrain here is so different to where we're from. Like we're not used to seeing stuff like this, so it's pretty, pretty interesting to say the least. Like these hills, you never see that back home. This is Madonna's house from back in the day, not recently, but a while ago, and it used to be painted yellow and red, so that's how you knew it was her house. Now it's all white. Crazy. Just that's one awesome. more little Hollywood fat toy. <laughs> Just made it to Abby and Christine's and Ben's house. 
So yeah. Oh. Oh, I love you. No, I, don't, I love her. I love her. Don't you? Yeah. you mind if I film everything? No, please. Sweet. So we made it to Abby's house. Her backyard is amazing. Look at this. We got the pool. Clementine. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. Oh, these are oranges, yeah? Oh, yeah. That's Straight crazy. Up. Straight up. Scrum. Punch. Let me see that thing. Check it. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Almost went in the pool. Okay. Like, uh, climbing is not really my thing. I'm a singer. <laughs> I'm with you, except I'm not a singer, but climbing is not my thing either. What made you think of skunks? They can be scary. Because they're, um, so they're related to skunks. But what made you think of skunks? We used to have skunk cabbage in our Uncle Tom's. <laughs> there you go. When we were, when Ben and I were kids, we'd smell skunk cabbage. That's true. And when we were teenagers as well. That's true. <laughs> Fair point. It's not wrong. <laughs> Bye, Plummy. Right. I think what the plan for us was like rodeo. Yep. Yeah. So we're gonna drive. We're gonna drive over the hills uh, through Coldwater Canyon, which is a really cool, like curvy road that goes over, and uh, you have really good views from up there. And then we'll be on basically right in Beverly Hills, right on Rodeo, and then we can get out and just walk around for a second if you guys Yeah, want. that'd be Sweet. fun. So yeah. Just to say we did it. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. $30 million each, too. Really? Yeah. I just saw two women in their tennis skirts and tennis rackets. Right. Where'd you take us, Ben? Beverly Hills. Beverly We're gonna do it up on Rodeo. Yes, sir. Uh, Go. Take me to my people. <laughs> for real. Let's go, man. So crazy to be here. Thank you to Ben for taking us everywhere. Hell yeah, man. Love it. Love it. Ooh. This is crazy. That's like Huge shout out to Ben for being our tour guide for the day. Absolutely. Thank you, ben. And Christine. Yeah. Christine, Christine was the Christine has been great too. as well. She's been great as well, but... Now we're going to party. Party. <laughs> okay, so now we just finished up with our touristy day and everything, but now we are going back to Ben, Abby, and Christine's house to have kind of a little big get together for the whole cast, uh, most of the cast of Love on the Spectrum, which we're super excited about. So that was kind of like the big thing we we're doing today. But uh, yeah, I'll pick up the camera when we get there. So yeah. Right? No, no, that's not right. I can do it. I'll take it. You can use my camera. So a little backstory on the next clip. I have a lion tattoo on my leg. And if for those who have watched the show, Abby and David both are obsessed with lions. And so I thought it would be really cool to get their reaction of that tattoo. So here that is for you guys. I really just want to get, both of you, David, I want to get your reaction on something, okay? What is it? I get more. Oh! Wow, my favorite! Oh. It's my lion tattoo. The lion of God, I love it! Isn't it cool? Yes. Oh, for me, the show has meant, um, the, we could have never imagined. We watched the show from 2019 in Australia. Right, yeah. We fell yeah. in love. I don't know if it was the algorithms on my Netflix, but this show popped up one night and I was home and I'm like, what is this? And I'll be honest, when I first saw the title, I thought, oh, someone's getting a well-worded email because uh, <laughs> they're going to exploit people with autism. Mama Bear was getting up out of her time. So I turned it on because I was ready to fight and I fell in love. I fell in love with the show and I did from 2019. And so then we watched and watched and watched and then I thought, gosh, I wish they would bring this to America. And then they did. It was like, perfect. And they did. They brought it to America. And I fell in love with all of you. And I honestly really cannot believe I'm standing here. <laughs> so humbled and grateful doesn't cover what our family feels. And that's thanks to you guys. And uh, we can't believe we're here next shoulder to shoulder with you trailblazers because we're just the season oh two gosh. kids. <laughs> but I do have to say what this show has meant for our family, specifically Connor, 
is opportunity that I never thought my son would have. And the acceptance and the opportunity that Connor has now because of this show. And, um, and I feel so compelled, and we feel compelled as a family to give back to that community and serve mm -hmm. and give it all and pay it forward. And, and just, we are grateful to be here. We are, it is not lost on us. We have not lost the plot, how lucky we are. <laughs> we pulled the golden ticket from Willy Wonka's chocolate factory. <laughs> yeah. We are eating the candy bar, but we're gonna share it. So we just did a big group picture with everybody. That was super fun, but I'm kind of going to keep the camera away from this one. I got a few clips and whatnot, but uh, this is just a super fun moment. kind of just want to live in the moment. Uh, but yeah, I'll share the pictures and everything, all the clips I've gotten. So thank you for watching. So I really hope you guys enjoyed watching our first little segment of the trip to LA. We still have a lot of fun things planned. And uh, in the next video for our second part, we... Uh, we go to Disneyland and we do a lot of fun things as well, so please tune in for then. But seriously, thank you guys so much for posting three videos, the support I've had, and just the love you guys have shown. I really appreciate just watching and subscribing. So uh, seriously, this is all because of you guys. Our life is flipped upside down, Connor's life especially, and it's so incredible that I get to experience and, uh, and us as his family get to experience this alongside him. So we're all Team Connor. We love him. We love this situation. But really, it's thanks to you guys and the, the endless amount of support. We just – words can't describe our gratitude to you guys. So, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Please like and subscribe. And, uh, yeah, tune in for the next video.